when we want to look at, you see the ominous clouds in the background here, and take a look at this radar. So there are already warnings in effect just to the west of where we are in the track. And because of that, NASCAR and the track have decided that in the interest of safety, they don't want fans, they don't want crew members, they don't want anyone being out in the elements and in the open uh, for the rest of the evening. And so they have already canceled, uh, postponed, I should say, the Xfinity Series race. It will now be tomorrow at noon. So the Xfinity Series race from Kentucky is going to be tomorrow at noon on NBCSN. We'll have NASCAR pre-race, NASCAR America pre-race at 6, the countdown to green at 7, and then the Monster Energy Series race from Kentucky at 7.30. So it will be another doubleheader. Guys, we saw it yesterday, or excuse me, last week at Daytona, the doubleheader. We're going to do it one more time. Oh, this is old hat. We got this doubleheader thing down. But, uh, you know, there's nothing you can do about the weather. I mean, what makes NASCAR great are these venues we go to, When unfortunately when you talk about a mile-and-a-half racetrack, Unless somebody knows a way to cover it that I don't know of, you, you are always going to be subject to the elements. And, and that is not a light green little shower we saw on the radar. There's some reds and purples. Oh, yes. And I'm no weatherman, but every time Jim Cantori shows up on my TV screen, <laughs> there are reds and purples. So he doesn't just talk about you know light weather. So I, I'm thinking this is a great decision, and this will allow the fans to plan their day tomorrow, come out and have a great time here at Kentucky Speedway, enjoy the festivities right out here on the front stretch, and have a good day of racing.